नमस्ते व्यास वेलकम टू डी एम एस्ट्रोलॉजी टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी अ वेरी लग्जरियस टॉपिक ऑफ अ ड्रीम कार एवरीबडी विश दैट दे शुड गेट अ ड्रीम कार डज एवरीबडी गेट द ड्रीम कार नाउ दैट डिपेंड्स दैट हाउ योर ड्रीम इज वॉट टाइप ऑफ अ कार or what kind of a planet you have in your chart in childhood when we drive we go to anywhere with our parents car or public vehicle or anyway when we see others to travel by their luxurious car we always have a dream that uh, in one day i will also buy see that dream is very important because whatever dream you do in the day time is all planted in the 10th house and the dreams what you see in the night by your subconscious mind that plants in your 4th house so if your 4th house and 10th house both are very uh, attached to each other you'll immediately get the transformation from 4th house to 10000 and 10000 to 4000 let it not go into the technicality but dream cars is today young generations very passionate subject and now you see the all the youngsters are purchasing their dream cars at very early age those in olden days people purchase their vehicle by age of 35 40 now today's just 25 year young graduate just uh, started career person purchase it car actually the car is come under the movable pleasure or movable asset and all movable things are under the venus all the pleasure which is fixed immovable that is all mars that is why land building property agriculture land everything belongs to the mars in fourth house and whatever the movable properties like a cash like car is a movable thing like a ornaments like you have a black money lifestyle it's all movable that all covers under the domain of a venus <coughs> venus gives the two things one as a material pleasure also and second is a only pleasure means what you enjoy by that material pleasure i have already discussed the d4 and d16 my uh, sincere request is to just go through d4 and d16 chart also chaturthaunsh and d16 sastaunsh d4 gives you a uh, uh, assets which is uh, Uh, old created by your parents you can say by parents also or by way of others whereas this uh, d16 because when we are in the d16 chart i said you that d16 is a very important for self generated wealth you understand that all the self generated wealth is created on the d16 very very important because whether you are going to have your own we uh, means uh, created or you will be getting from your parents right so d4 and d16 we have already seen the difference how the your uh, assets will be that so in d16 we have already discussed the vehicle part the sum of the part d4 is a general wealth common wealth where you can't name it and d16 is a specific wealth where you name it as a car as a property anything see today we all know that a vehicle as a venus if you purchase a vehicle of a, suppose a 50 lakhs 25 lakhs whatever and simultaneously if you purchase a property of the same value definitely the property will be giving you a good increase that will be always growing whereas if you purchase a vehicle it will put a depreciation even the next day onward your depreciation will start it call as a second hand whereas property even the second hand also have a same value so here main important is that 
that it generate by the venus you have to see the venus and those whose venus is powerful in the chart they can enjoy anything now here there is a difference here is that whether you have your own vehicle or you will be travelling with the company vehicle your parents own vehicle your friends vehicle or any other vehicle so that differentiate we are going to see today now if that is a micro analysis of a fourth house now you have to see whether your fourth lord is powerful or your venus from the fourth house is powerful because fourth lord whoever is a fourth lord that that fourth lord will gives you a title of that property suppose your fourth lord is good from the fourth house if it is place kendra trikona then you will get uh, your all the assets all the uh, pleasure item in your own name you own the home in your own name you own the vehicle by your own name so the owner of the fourth house will give you a title being a owner whereas the karaka the significator of fourth house that is mars venus mercury whatever we are here talking about the venus so venus being a karak significator of all movable particularly a vehicle if your venus is powerful from fourth house now here you have to see bhavarth bhavam so from fourth house your venus is placed well that means you are going to own your own vehicle sorry fourth lord if fourth lord is uh, placing well from fourth house then you will be owning the vehicle whereas if the venus is only a powerful that means you always get a pleasure you never own your vehicle but you will always get a pleasure from the vehicle like in the family of a four person husband wife and children the vehicle will be in the name of husband but all other three are also using so other three is venus is powerful whereas the person who is having a fourth lord as a powerful whose name is there his uh, fourth lord is powerful so that differentiate person should be known that whether your fourth house lord is powerful or whether your fourth karaka is powerful suppose your fourth lord is powerful that means you can own any number of pleasure in your title but simultaneously if the significator a karak is weak in your chart you will not able to enjoy that things you'll be only a medium to purchase that vehicle that property and others will be utilizing i have seen the person owning the mercedes car my one of a client is owning the mercedes car he and his uh, driver both was called by the uh, mercedes company they say that uh, we accordingly design if your height is shorter longer than accordingly your vehicle will be designed you see the driver who he, he also got the uh, opportunity to go to the germany in mercedes company and give the uh, its uh, length so the driver is having a venus powerful and he is enjoying more his owner will be always go up going and coming only the maximum time the driver uh, pick up and drop and everywhere the driver utilize more so those who are occupier their venus is powerful those whose fourth lord is powerful they are the owner and and if you are fourth lord is also powerful and your venus is also powerful that means you are going to own a vehicle dream vehicle and you yourself going to enjoy that vehicle that best this uh, vehicle you gives now what happen in the certain ascendant right if you take a aquarius ascendant if you take the aquarius ascendant the fourth lord will be venus so if venus plays well you own all the luxurious car you know we have a example of uh, mr amitabh bachchan he is a aquarius ascendant and fourth lord venus is seated well so he is owning all the luxurious car and enjoying also so this way if your fourth lord automatically become venus then your lord and karaka both are same same thing happen in the 
Cancer ascendant. Cancer ascendant also the fourth lord is Venus. Fourth Karga is also Venus. See this vehicle is not come some days in the recent life. It is since the inception. People previously using the animals as a horse, as a... See you know all the gods are having their own vehicles. Like Ganesh ji having a vehicle of a, a mouse. Shiv ji as a bull. So every, every... Every uh, this um, uh, since a uh, god era to our human era, the vehicle was a continuum. Maybe you have a luxurious vehicle, maybe you have a vehicle, maybe you don't have a good lug uh, vehicle. So vehicle particularly is a fourth house and Karaka is a fourth. If your Venus is combust, any house, if any house the Venus is combust, you may purchase the vehicle, but you will never use that vehicle. That is so said. Whenever this person purchase, he purchase to just show up, but his own interest is very less. Whenever Venus is combust in anybody's chart, in my Venus video also I said, if Venus is combust, you have no interest in anything. Rus, ruchi, rus. You don't have any interest in any pleasure. In any pleasure, you have an excuse. Suppose this person purchased the vehicle whose Venus is uh, combust. Then what happened that uh, their family say, let us go and uh, just have a long drive. No, no, there is so much traffic. No, no, there is a uh, petrol price is so high. We will not get a parking. There is a traffic. So many excuses this person will give. But he will not utilize the vehicle. So vehicle owning, vehicle enjoying, both are different things. So Venus should not be combust. If your Venus is combust, don't purchase the vehicle in your name. If your Venus is debilitated, if your Venus is debilitated, don't purchase the vehicle in your name. Otherwise, that vehicle may create some issue and that you are going to suffer. If your Venus is with the moon, you will have a luxurious car. What is your dream? What you have thought about? The same vehicle you will be owning. Very good. If your Venus is with the Sun and not being combust, then it is called Vaibhav Yoga. Due to this Vaibhav Yoga, because Moon, Venus and Sun, Venus both create the Vaibhav Yoga. So you also have a good show of car. Like today's time, it's a Mercedes, it's a BMW, it's a Rolls Royal, it's a Bucati, this all kind of a luxurious vehicle. So that is the Sun, Venus, Moon, Venus. If Mars and Venus is there, they always keep their vehicle very shiny. Their interior, interior of a car is also a very luxurious. Wooden paneling and uh, all seats are so comfortable. They have a handrest. So this kind of a luxurious thing. If a Mer Mercury and a Venus is together related to your 4000, you are better to purchase the commercial vehicle rather than your uh, domestic uh, vehicle. So, use the commercial vehicle that will be good for you. If uh, Jupiter and Venus are there, you can have a family car, big and family car. If your Venus is with the Saturn, then you are going to utilize your vehicle very, very much. Because Saturn is a continuous use. And that is why maybe a transporter, maybe a tour operator, they all have a Venus Saturn combination where they utilize the vehicle more. So depreciation with the three years they scrap the car because so many kilometers they drive and they sell. Venus Rahu is together, you are attracted with the vehicle but your vehicle always face some or other dent, crack, dash, anything. So always your car or vehicle is always somewhere. Uh, either the uh, tire will be puncture often, either you will be uh, scratch will be there either there is a denting or banting in your car so that is a Venus Rahu you are not able to enjoy and then you just run the car many people own the so luxurious car but they the interior is so fear there is a dusting in the car or there might be a stinking a smell in from the car this is all a Venus Rahu Venus Ketu combination so Venus should not be combust, it should not be debilitated, it should not be seated with the Rahu Ketu. Then only the vehicle cannot be enjoyed. Your fourth load is totally different. 
right fourth lot gives the ownership of a vehicle whether you will be able to purchase a property or not the right time for owning is own vehicle is either uh, second dasha if your first dasha is too long so you can purchase in the second dasha or you can purchase in the fourth dasha see fourth dasha is to upgrade your pleasure if you are using a cycle use scooter bike bike if you are using bike then convert it to in the car if you are using a car go for the luxurious and higher ended car so this is a fourth dasha and i have experienced myself in fourth dasha i have also taken so many cars by improving uh, from two wheeler to four wheeler so still it is continue if you purchase the car in the third dasha then it will create some tension worries or problem if in your chart the mars and rahu is together and if it is in the kendra or eighth house you should not drive yourself it's called akasmat yog you also have to see whether the mars and rahu dasha appears or not whenever the mars rahu are conjunct in the uh, transit also at that time also many accidents happen and if it is passing from your own mars and rahu natal mars rahu seated and if the mars rahu is transited that's a prompt time for vehicle accident so be careful whenever the uh, rahu or mars to get the transit over your fourth house over your venus then it may be a chance that you might be getting a accident yoga and if it is connected with your eighth house it is very dangerous it may cause your life also so vehicle dream vehicle the good time is the second dasha fourth dasha fourth dasha is to update your vehicle for getting a good vehicle your fourth lot should be powerful your vena should be powerful vena should not be combust vena should not be debilitated should not be seated with rahu and ketu and from fourth house it should not sit at 6 8 and 12 if from fourth house venus is seated means if your venus is seated in the ninth house 11th house and third house you may own the vehicle but you will not able to enjoy the vehicle especially the 11th house venus their vehicle may be enjoyed by their friends only their vehicle may be enjoyed by somebody else but he for himself could not able to enjoy because the karak goes eight from 4th house it goes to 8th house that is why so dream vehicle if you wish to purchase just see how your venus is there how your fourth dasha is going to come how your second dasha has gone so accordingly you can decide and whenever your venus in the transit if the venus in the transit is very powerful if it is comes under the own sign taurus and libra or in the uh this uh, pisces sign this is a right time to purchase the vehicle so that you will be immediately start enjoying the vehicle you will not face any problem in your vehicle so branded vehicle good vehicle and a new vehicle if your venus is so powerful if your venus is with the saturn if your venus is not placed well in the chart 2 3 and 11 from 4th house means if it is sitting in 6th house Uh, seventh house, or it is seated in the second house. Then you should purchase the second end prob second end uh, vehicle or um, uh, old vehicle. Then it will be benefit for you. So likewise, this is a great time to enjoy your own vehicle. If you are not fit with the any yoga, if your fourth lord is not so powerful, and if your Venus is not so powerful, that means you are going to travel with the public vehicle, or you will be enjoying the company of your other person. Maybe in your cha uh, child chart, or maybe in your wife chart, if there it is a powerful, then you should purchase the vehicle in their name. respective name if your child is having a good yoga then you can go for your son name vehicle or if uh, your wife chart is good then you can go for with the your wife chart and purchase in her name so to get a dream car dream vehicle this is a right time and you will be surprising sometime jupiter transit from the kendra if jupiter transit from the 1 4 7 10 that's also a time to increase your wealth increase your vehicle uh, pleasure increased by way of uh, purchasing the vehicle because ultimately vehicle is one is for necessity and second is for luxury and comfort 
you have your own car so you are free to move you can uh, come and go anytime and you enjoy so get enjoyment with your own vehicle just check whether you have a good vehicle yog or not and accordingly decide and enjoy so hope you like this uh, vehicle and material um, uh, yeah, pleasure yoga do like share and subscribe my channel dm astrology do share my videos to others for consultation you can always contact me in my email dm astrology1 at the red gmail.com and for other we uh, are uh, articles you can always connect with me in my facebook page dm astrology dharmesh mehta or in instagram also you can follow me in dm astrology so thank you very much again viewer namaste enjoy your dream vehicle thank you